What's up world, Matt here, and today I want to practice talking about personal technology items with you. I'm going to share with you some of the personal technology items that I use every day, and then we can practice pronouncing those words together. So first off, here's the piece of technology that I use most on a daily basis. Do you know what this is? Yeah, this is my smartphone or my phone. I use this every day. Um, I could also call this a phone, but this is a smartphone and this phone is not smart. I could call this a mobile phone or a cellular phone, but this is a smartphone. This is also a phone, but this is a banana phone. Do you know how to answer a banana phone? Ring ring. Yellow. I'm sorry, that's a bad joke. This is actually a Bluetooth headset that can connect to my phone. I don't use this piece of personal technology every day, but sometimes when I want to be funny, I can use my Bluetooth accessory with my smartphone. Another piece of technology equipment that I use every day is this. Do you know what this is? Yeah, this is a case. This is something I use for some protection for my phone. You can see my case is green. Green is my favorite color. So my case matches my shirt and sometimes it even matches my lights. So my smartphone and my case are pieces of technology that I use every day. But because I'm using them every day, there's two other accessories that have become very important to me. Do you know what this is? Yeah, this is a charger. This is something that you plug into the wall to provide electricity to a phone. You can use this to help charge a piece of personal electronic device, right? Now, this is a charger that I use in the United States. If I wanted to use it, for example, in Brazil, I might need an adapter. And so I'd plug my charger into the adapter and then the adapter into the wall. But then this charger can charge my smartphone. Except I'm missing something. I need one more accessory. What do I need to connect my charger to my smartphone? Yeah, I need a cable. This is the cable that I use to charge my phone every day. If you look close, what color is it? It's green, my favorite color. It goes with the case and the shirt and even my eyes. So I can use my charger and my cable together to charge my smartphone, even when it's in its case. There's two other accessories that I use very frequently. I really like music. And so every day I like to listen to music. When I want to listen to music and share with other people, I use this. Do you know what this is? Yeah, this is a speaker. This Bluetooth speaker connects to my phone and lets me play music loudly for other people to hear. That's why I like my Bluetooth speaker. Sometimes I wanna to listen to music by myself though. And when I wanna to listen to music by myself, I need these. Do you know what these are? Yeah, these are my headphones. I have these big headphones because I like to listen to music and make music. And these are the headphones that I use in the studio. These headphones are very old. I've had these headphones for 14 years. They've been with me for my entire musical journey. So that's the last accessory that I use on a daily basis with my personal technology. Now, I wanna practice those words by asking you some questions. I'll show you an object and ask you a question, and I want you to think if the answer is yes or no. Let's start off with an easy one. Is this a smartphone? Yeah, this is my smartphone. Is this a case? Yeah, this is a case. Is this a cable? 
No, this is not a cable. This is a charger. Is this a cable? Yeah, this is a cable. Is this a speaker? Yeah, this is a speaker. And is this a speaker? No, this is not a speaker. This is a speaker. These are headphones. Listen to the difference there. This is a speaker. These are headphones. Head phones. Phones, like two phones. I could have one phone, two phones, and I can listen like this. That's why we call them phones. There's one, two different parts that make music. These headphones have two speakers, right? Inside of here, there's one speaker, and inside of here, there's a second speaker. So when I wanna talk about the speaker, I say, is this a speaker? Yes, this is a speaker, one. But when I wanna talk about these, I say, are these headphones? Yeah, these, one, two, are headphones. All right, let's practice again faster and see if we can keep up with all of the vocabulary and the these for the headphones. Is this a smartphone? No, this is a case. Is this a charger? No, this is a cable. Is this a smartphone? No, this is a mobile phone or a cell phone. Is this a smartphone? Yeah, this is a smartphone. Are these headphones? No, this is a speaker. Are these headphones? Yeah, these are headphones. Is this a charger? Yeah, this is a charger. Nice job keeping up, even when I was asking those questions faster. Now, I want you to practice pronouncing those words. I'm going to show you one of my personal technology objects, and I'm gonna ask you, what is this? Or, what are these? And I want you to answer by telling me what the object is. If you're feeling like you're doing a good job remembering these words, I really want you to focus on the pronunciation. Try to say the words clearly, and then listen when I say the correct answer. And notice if your pronunciation is the same. All right, let's practice. What is this? What is this? Yeah, this is a smartphone or a phone. This is a phone. What is this? Yeah, this is a case. What is this? Yeah, this is a cable, a cable. What is this? This is a charger, charger, ch ch j j charger, nice. What are these? Yeah, these are headphones. And what is this? Yeah, this is a speaker. All right, I think you're ready for even more of a challenge. Now, I'm going to show you two different objects and I'm gonna ask you, what are these? Because remember, we use these when we're talking about at least two different objects, right? One speaker, two speakers. For instance, I could say, what are these? And you would look and say, oh, a cell phone and a case. Yeah, these are a cell phone and a case. Or what are these? Yeah, a charger and a cable. What are these? Yeah, headphones and a speaker. What are these? Yeah, a mobile phone and a smartphone. What are these?
Nice. A speaker and a cable. What are these? Yeah, headphones and a charger. Nice job. You were remembering those words even when I asked about multiple objects very fast. Now I want to play a guessing game with you. I'm going to choose one of my objects in secret and I'm going to give you two descriptions about my object. I want you to think and try and remember which object I'm describing. Let's try it out. All right. The first object that I'm thinking of is long and green. What object is long and green? Yeah, my cable is long and green. Nice. Okay, let's try another one. Hmm. My object is small and white. My object is small and white. Do you remember which object is small and white? Yeah, my charger is small and white. Nice. Okay. Hmm. My object is thin and green. My object is thin and green. Hmm, which object is thin and green? Yeah, my case is thin and green. My case is thin and green. Hmm, which object is big and old? Hmm, my object is big and old. Which object is big and old? Yeah, my headphones are big and they're 14 years old. My headphones are big and old. Which object is gray and portable? Which object is gray and portable? Yeah, my speaker is gray and portable. My speaker is gray and portable. All right, one last secret object. My object is small and black. My object is small and black. Yeah, my smartphone is small and black. I like it to be small so it can easily fit in my pocket, but not this pocket. No one ever uses those pockets. Nice job guessing my objects. For one final activity, I want you to practice describing to me your personal technology items. I'm going to ask you about one of your personal technology items and I want you to try and say at least two descriptions about that object. Maybe you can say the color, the size, something about its age, whatever you can think of to describe your object. And if you don't have one, that's okay. Just say, I don't have a speaker or I don't have headphones. Remember, these are the objects I use every day, but you might use different technology every day. That's okay. So can you describe for me your cell phone? What are some descriptions of your cell phone? Try saying, my cell phone is... Nice. Now try describing your case. Say, my case is... Good work. All right. How about your charger? Can you try describing the charger that you use to charge your phone? My charger is... Good work. How about your cable? How would you describe your cable? You could say my cable is... And it, do you have a speaker? How would you describe your speaker? Nice. And finally, your headphones. How would you give a description of your headphones? Are they big or maybe they're small little earbuds? Say, my headphones are... Nice work. Well, great job today practicing this personal technology vocabulary. Keep practicing, and I'll look forward to seeing you in the future. Bye.